Welcome to the Crypto Investments Channel. In this video, I will talk about Stellar Lumens price prediction and Stellar Lumens news today. If you like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Write in the comments your price forecast for Stellar Lumens in 2022. Stellar is a distributed open source and community-owned blockchain network. Stellar was founded by lawyer Joyce Kim and Jed McCaleb in 2014. It is used to facilitate transfers between assets. Stellar is committed to facilitating these transfers for a fraction of a penny, while striving to be an open financial system and provide people of all income levels with access to affordable financial services. Stellar's own digital currency is called Lumens XLM. To protect against spam, there is a requirement that each Stellar wallet contains at least a small amount of Lumens. With Lumens, users can send each other any currency, automatically converting it to any other. Stellar also supports smart contracts. So let's start with the most important news of the past days about AmpCoin. Russia ban in focus is MetaMask, OpenSea abide by US sanctions. OpenSea, the world's largest NFT marketplace, reportedly began blocking Iranian users citing US sanctions against the country, while popular Ethereum wallet MetaMask was unavailable in certain blacklisted countries due to restrictions by its hosting fur. The move sparked widespread debate over the supposedly decentralized nature of crypto, and whether other major companies would also fall in line with US blacklists against Russia. So far, most major exchanges have said they will not block Russian users. OpenSea and MetaMask both affected by sanctions Iranian users were reportedly blocked by OpenSea starting Thursday. The NFT marketplace, which is headquartered in New York, said while it was sorry for the impacted users, it was required to follow US sanction laws. Venezuelan users were also unable to access Ethereum wallet MetaMask, although the move appeared to be part of a broader crackdown by Infer, through which MetaMask accesses the blockchain. Infer then clarified that, while blocking Venezuela was unintentional, it had blacklisted several other countries sanctioned by the United States, including two separatist regions in Ukraine. It was not immediately clear whether the two services were available in Russia. Western sanctions against Russia, some of the strictest seen yet, went into effect from March 1. Russian crypto sanctions a point of focus Binance, the world's largest crypto exchange, said well it will comply with you. As sanctions in blocking certain Russian entities, it will not impose a blanket ban on Russian users. Others, including Kraken, have also said they will not ban citizens in the country. Their comments come in the wake of a request from the Ukrainian government to blacklist Russian users. The Ukraine government also offered a bounty for any information on the wallets of Russian and Belarusian. The move attracted criticism from the crypto community, specifically on the grounds that the space is not supposed to see interference from regulators or politics. But given that so many crypto platforms run on centralized infrastructure, it would make them subject to regulation. Speculation has also grown over whether Russia could use crypto to bypass the new sanctions, although experts dismiss the notion. The United States recently added crypto to its Russian sanctions and warned exchanges against transacting with blacklisted entities. The European Union also said it would take steps to ensure Russia does not evade sanctions through crypto. The next news, the ethics of banning crypto for regular Russian citizens. Crypto exchanges freeze Russian accounts Russian civilians are bearing the brunt of things as multiple crypto exchanges cut ties with Russian account in 2022. Interestingly, the Jairus refused to accept the refund because the IRS didn't acknowledge the true reasoning for issuing the refund. This reasoning is essential to create a precedent for other stakers to protect themselves from IRS scrutiny in the future. The Jairus decided to take this to the court to get a formal court ruling. Motion to dismiss dated February 28, 2022, in a court document dated February 28, 2022, the Tax Davison of U.S. Department of Justice, Dodge, dismissed the Jairus attempt to get an official ruling from the court on staking. In the document, the Dodge argues that the Jairus case is moot, in other words, there's no issue that remains unsettled, open to argument or debatable, because the IRS has issued a full refund including the interest, exactly what the Jairus requested. Here, the United States granted a full refund of the amount the Jairus asked for in the complaint, with interest and without receiving anything in return. It was not an offer to compromise the case with each party giving up something. Thus, there is nothing left to adjudicate. Plaintiff sued for a refund and received a full refund. When the United States tenders full payment of a refund even during litigation no case or controversy remains, and the refund claim is moot moreover, the Dodge disagrees with the position that the Jairus can seek to get a court ruling on staking income by refusing to accept the refund. The Dodge argues that the court can issue a refund for any reason other than the one raised by the taxpayer. The Jairus also initiated this lawsuit to find out the reasons behind the IRS issuing a refund so they, and others, can use this as a basis to protect themselves from future IRS scrutiny on similar matters. The Dodge stresses that prospective relief is unavailable in a refund suite. Each tax year is unique, and a court ruling related to a certain tax year cannot be relied upon to get relief for future years. 
In certain cases, there are exceptions to the concept of moot mentioned here. The Dodge also explains that the Jairus case is not eligible for any of these exceptions to warrant a court case either. For all the above reasons, the Dodge believes that the court should dismiss the case. The crypto space will soon become mainstream. Each project offers unique plans for survival and dominance in the market. We will try to answer these frequently asked questions. Is Stellar XLM a good investment? How much will Stellar cost in 2025? But in reality, guessing price fluctuations and forecasting future prices is a hell of a task. But let's not waste time and proceed to the forecast, and we will start from the current year 2022. But perhaps I will clarify that at the moment the price of Stellar fluctuates around 18 cents United States dollars XLM rate prediction 2022. For a long-term forecast of the Stellar price, basic analysis is important. In terms of industry benefits, the native token offers several. The autonomy of the digital economy makes it ideal. As DAP and stablecoins evolve, the network offers competitive programmable payment, logistics, and storage options. There is a chance that the average price of XLM will rise to around 26 cents by 2022, if the idea attracts more investors. For 2022, the year may end with a maximum price of 29 cents with a minimum price. 26 cents level. XLM rate prediction 2023, XLM will be seen as the best option, and with a huge community, the stellar price will reach new highs. Price swings are hard to predict, especially if the market is more bullish or bearish than ever. For the year 2023, the stellar rate will be almost 38 cents. The maximum bet we can get is 45 cents. Stellar average price prediction for the end of 2023 could be around 39 cents. A huge price turnover is expected in the range determined by the cryptocurrency market. Stellar price prediction 2024, volatility drives the cryptocurrency market. Today it is not easy to predict and keep up with current prices. This is where many cryptanalysts come into play. Price projections are correct for the years indicated. Cryptocurrency consumers remain concerned about cryptocurrency bans and new restrictions. Stellar could cross 65 cents if the market sees a nice bull run in 2024. Given that it is expected to be owned by long-term investors, its average price for 2024 will be around 56 cents. Stellar Price Prediction 2025, XLM has huge potential, with certain interactions and innovations, it is possible to increase the number of users and advertising. If the market focuses on investing in Stellar, the price could rise much higher. By 2025, it may reach a maximum value of 94 cents. XLM is expected to reverse slightly if the market goes down. The year 2025 could end with an average price of 81 cents, a minimum price of 79 cents, and a maximum price of 94 cents. Stellar Price Prediction 2026, it appears that by 2026, Stellar, XLM, prices will reach a level similar to their previous all-time high. For 2026, we can expect the average rate to be $1.19. If everything goes smoothly, we predicted that Stellar's maximum price could be up to $1.37 in 2026. Of course, there are chances that the market will fall after a long bull run, and this is normal for the cryptocurrency market. XLM Rate Prediction 2027, a flawless approach to this currency can be found on many websites and forums. According to this prediction platform, Stellar will remain at its current level for a very long time.